I almost spelled a scrape mechanic there. Uh, this is patently false, but I'll give you points for trying. Yay, points! I love points. Okay. Okay, so, here's the earth, round, and we're going to, uh, dick with physics today. Yes! What are we gonna do? Uh, I'm redoing the elevator system. Are we gonna be doing the crazy things you discovered the other day? I think so. Okay, that's the important thing. I'm just gonna strap an engine on. Just over on the side, people turn it on, on and off at their will. Actually, that's probably a terrible idea, but whatever. Okay, we want to do the reverse, and please fire me up the elevator. Oh. Bird help. I'll help in a second. Bird help. Uh, what's, what's up? <laughs> what, what happened? What happened? Oh no. Oh no. You need help. How help? How can help? Uh, to just, just make it go by. <laughs> that works. That was kind of a silly solution. I like how you bounced off of the thing. Alright, let's go ahead and plonk this in here. What? What? Well, what? What? Why do you have what? a why do you have a sensor there? I don't have shit anywhere. You put a sensor in there. Why? I I don't know. Why didn't he, why the sensor was always there? Oh. You know what? That's actually kind of cool. You should what, put it on the like bottom a though. Ding yeah. Whenever the elevator shows up. You should yeah, have it at the bottom so. though. What do you mean? Mm -hmm. All right, fair enough. So whenever the elevator bonks down. Yeah. Wait. I'm gonna make something that has maximum potential for annoyance. Okay. Oh. So I'm going to walk Getting around. Getting out and of I'm the shaft is quite difficult. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm going to walk around and I'm going to dislodge the elevator because it's still going. And what is? The, the elevator. elevator is how? Yeah. It's stuck. And broken. I don't... Which Look part up. of the elevator? Look up. The important part of the elevator. Oh, you want me to go over here and look up? Like, through the... Oh, I see. I see what the issue was. Or is. <laughs> okay. So do you have any other alternative ideas for uh, what to do? For the... Uh... In general or for the elevator? Uh, I was thinking the elevator, but I was also thinking in terms of like transportation between the two tree houses. Um, you know, it's a shame that the monorail couldn't work out, but I think that we definitely have to go ahead and say that that one's abandoned. What we can do in terms of transportation is, uh, it'd be kind of funny if we had, like, some sort of rocket-based, like, weirdness. Like, okay. I'd almost say, like, monorail seats that are just, like, done via rockets, but I guess we're probably abandoning that idea. Okay, so here's an we... idea. Here's an yeah. idea. This is, this is crazy. Uh-huh. Um, how about... How about it's a rotating thing? Like a where, big rotating walkway or something? Yes, but with thrusters. So you hop in a car, and then uh, you hit the wait, switch. Wait, like a teacup ride? Yeah. That's super... That works. The problem with, like, a lot of the other plans they can think of is that they don't really work both directions. Wherein, like, if somebody you know, gets into your car or whatever and goes off with it, there's no way to get, like, summon another car from the other yeah, side. Yeah, but if we but have... But teacups would work. Yeah, if we have a perfect counterbalance, unless the, uh... Unless the person decided to, um... Uh, unless, like, whomever getting in your car... Like, that that person decides to, uh, just hop out midway. Uh-huh. We could just have, like, this nice little pleasant teacup rocket ride. Yeah, I think that would work. Actually, okay. weirdly enough. 
I'll rebuild the platform across. This way we can always just go back and fix it if it breaks. Okay. I'll be up there in a second. I'm currently working on a pet project. The Anoimotron uh, 2000. Worse than the horns. Oh, significantly worse than the horns. Is... You should probably have it so it only goes once, though. If, like, when you hit the bottom. Because if it's on oh, continuous... Oh, no, 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 this is a different... This is a different okay. project here. This is completely removed from that, uh... From what... From the uh, elevator project at this point. Because I was just thinking about the horrible... Life. Uh, uh, the horrible eventuality of you, uh, making it so it's just a constant horn noise any time the elevator is down, which should be all <laughs> the time, and it's just like, hmm. Actually, you want to do that so whenever it's up, uh, it starts making noises, that way you don't just leave it in the up position. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Uh... Yeah, hang on. Uh, but um, I see what you're saying. Okay, good. They're properly connected. Once again. There we are. That's significantly annoying enough. So, okay, so let me get in the elevator, go up to the top, and then the plan is... When it gets to the top, it just, like, makes a ding sound. Yeah, but, like, constant. Like, constant. Just ding, 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 ding. So that you have <laughs> no choice. Really enough, it doesn't seem to work anymore. Oh. That's unfortunate. Yeah. The elevator is uh, potentially stuck on the sensor at the bottom. Oh. Why don't you uh, surround the sensor in blocks so there's a platform around it? Because I could, I could yeah, see I it could do that. wedged on the sensor if it fell hard enough. Yeah, okay. I can do that really quick. It's going to change. No, it won't. Oh, wow. You made a like... modification to the elevator down there, and it screwed up my build all the way up here. <laughs> The, uh, lack of being able to place a block at the same time as me. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. I have to do- I have to measure? There needs to be, like, a ruler in this game. So, like, I can find the yeah. good point on any section. It would be pretty nice, huh? Oh, well. Definitely getting some odd lag tonight there. Yeah, so my my game is not fully functional, unfortunately for me. Yeah. I don't know if it's my Maybe. streaming setup or what. Uh, but it's it's just lagging just slightly. You know what? Uh I got some websites that I don't need open. Let's get rid of them. Okay, let's get on top of this thing. I'm gonna try now and see if this uh, elevator works now. Okay, it does. Good. So just as soon as it gets to the top, it just goes dying. It's an interesting, interesting strategy for uh, annoying people into putting the elevator back. Aww. Oh, I wasn't can... lined up correctly. So oh. I got, I got chuckled into the wall here. Oh yeah, we should probably switch to where we're playing scrap mechanic properly. I switched yeah. one of the announcements. Is there, is there anything that can be done if you get stuck in the wall by the elevator? Uh, sometimes hammer, usually I just put it on the lift, throw it off the railing. And that's usually good enough. I, I kind of can't do that. I'm coming. I'm sorry, Wander. Yeah, I think you need to come uh, get, the, get the elevator off me via a lift. Wander, clap. Clap. Clap, pulls. Oh, thank you. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh, it got what? stuck in the tree. Weird. Oh, <laughs> that is weird. Okay, I need to get back a uh, brick block here. You made it pretty far in Dark Souls today? I beat two bosses, which I feel really, really satisfied about. That counts as progress, yeah. I wish you could put the note blocks in a weird sequence thing. So you could do like, ding, ding, or something like that when the elevator arrives. Yeah, you could. Use a controller, can't you? 
Uh, the sensor into the controller, into the blocks, maybe. That'd be kind of cute, if it works. Yeah, you can't control note blocks with the controller. That sucks. So you can't do a sequencer with the, uh... Are you sure? With the, uh... Yeah. Because I swear that was, like, actually one of the functions that they mentioned that you could do with it. Oh, no. I'm, uh, I guess I can try, but... Bert. Oh, the elevator just came down. No. Oh, no, it was just the U. Oh. Just put Wait. a single... Yeah, there you go. Easy mode. Yeah, this controller only works with, uh, bearing things. Okay, so Bird, if I exit the universe, please understand. Uh, what are you, a dolphin? Maybe. I'll Did be you back. just amp up the thrusters? Hi. Um... It looked like whatever you did did not have a happy ending. <laughs> Wait, what the hell are you doing? What is going on up there? <laughs> Perfect. I'm. Uh, you know, it might be helpful to put like a little rim around the top of the elevator so that it uh, it forces you to stay like centered on it. Um. All right, I'm gonna turn off the uh. The Annoymotron, real quick. I'm noticing just how annoying the Annoymotron oh, no. is. <laughs> oh my god, it managed to make it seven million times worse. <laughs> wow. That, <laughs> that was special. So, if this, if the, um... Wow. So if the, uh... If the sensor goes off, like, on a regular interval, if, like, something is, like, spinning in front of it at the same speed over and over again, it only does it every once in a while. But if the speed of that thing is constantly changing, as in I turn the engine off and it gets slower, it freaks out and all the... And it just, like, keeps sensing over and over again. Which I didn't know was doable in this game. Because I thought there always had to be, like, a little lag between, um, sensor hits. Oh, what? Where's the... Where'd you put the elevator? I didn't put it anywhere. You knocked it over here. Oh, right. Hi. Okay. So this is either going to work hilariously poorly, or exactly the way I want it to. I'm gonna get on. Uh, I'm gonna need you to get off for like two seconds. Don't don't break us up. Don't break us up. This is going. Okay. <laughs> Well, it's fine. It's fine. Whatever happens was meant to happen. Uh, well. Huh. <laughs> um. Oh, well. How's it up? To, how's it going up there? Where are you? I got knocked through the bottom of the elevator and fell down the shaft. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Where are you? Fixing the elevator. <laughs> yeah, that will happen. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start stuff screwing around and go ahead and uh, look into the treehouse connection teacups ride here. Uh, how are we gonna connect it per se? I guess we could have like a. Um, do we have like a, a spinny like little fan blade thing go like extending from the ground up, or do you want to like suspend the teacup ride from one of the uh, either side of the um, treehouse? Three houses. Not sure yet. Uh, what we could do is make it insane and okay. have it so it uh, so it flips. What do you mean? Ah shit! Ah shit! Uh, well, luckily for you, I have some good news. You want to set it back down? Yeah, I'm right next to it. I can send it back down. Thank you. How do I make it? At, it's stuck. You're gonna have to put it hammer. on. A, you're gonna have to put it on a lift and knock it back down. Okay. So the problem Come is on. it goes. Let me hit it. There it goes. 
<laughs> it's really satisfying to watch. Yeah, it's really satisfying to do. Okay. The problem is that the physics in this game is very janky when it comes to collisions and, like, regular things. It's really good at, like, doing thrusters and and cars and stuff like that. But just, like, two objects touching each other, the game's like, Whoa, I do not know how to deal with this shit right now. Stranger danger! Stranger danger! Ah! It really does, like, just... It gets sad and scared and, you know... Panics. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna... Really try another idea, since, since it's on my mind. Go down a... Corner, a new type of corner block here. Okay, I've adjusted it. The elevator's at absolute minimum thrust. That might be a really good idea. Uh, it worked. Does it no longer get stuck in things? Yeah, it it did not have enough force to mash itself into the top. So we now have Finally. a fu functional elevator. Excellent. I'll make it so you don't fall out the sides, though, because that is still totally a problem. You listen to OC Remix? Yep. There were like some one. pretty awful ones earlier, like that Skyrim one. Ooh. But this one's good. What the fuck? What? Try a structure that kind of looks like this. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So now we've got a nice little elevator cage. Oh wait, no, this is perfect, because you can fall through the, the center of the elevator. Can you not? Damn it. Oh, you're trying to knock the dwarf through the top of the elevator into the bottom of it? No, 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 no. Because if so, that would be a very, very ingenious design. It would be. But no, I've got, I've got a perfectly functional elevator. You can drop down on top of it. It works perfectly. And we're great. Is that... Are you being serious? Because your tone made it sound like there's a bit of a death trap involved. I mean, I'm just waiting for it to fail, really. Ah, uh, true. I can understand that sentiment. That's how I feel with my programming assignments. These thicker beams aren't really doing it for me. I thought they would. I don't like them. I know what you could do. What? Frame them in with metal blocks. Because, like, you've already oh, got yeah. it on the bottom. Yeah, like, metal stuff. Yeah, so, like, it would look fine if you had it, like... Kind of like this. Yeah, that would work perfectly. Okay. Because there's the, your problem. Uh, and that way you what? can have the, uh... Then, that way you can have the, like, uh, you can have it turn. Like, right here. This looks kind of bad. Because they don't connect exactly? right. Well, like, these two oh, right yeah, here. Yeah. The L looks awful. So you could probably find something else. Okay. Now let me think. How do we want to do... Yeah, do we want to support this from the bottom? So, like, it looks like a gigantic fin uh, spinning fan? Or do we just... I got it. I don't here, know. We, here we go. Oh, so the um, the real problem is getting it to like rotate. We need to know how long it is. We don't have measuring tape, so we got to figure out something else instead. So I'm going to just lay pipes because uh -huh. it's a hell of a lot easier to count pipes than it is to count blocks. That's true. Yeah. So I'm just gonna lay pipes across, and then we'll figure out past that. Put down a little bit of. More metal cubes here. Is it an even pipe count? Okay. The answer is, oddly enough, yes. <laughs> it's actually an odd pipe count, which is even more perfect. Because oh. there's one yeah, block here. Yeah, because then we can put a, th a thing and, like, yeah, the right middle. in the middle of it. Yeah, okay, so let's count. Oh, one, that was two, lucky. Three. Let's 
17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Okay, so it's not as even as we thought. 31 pipes uh, means we have to go one short, but that's okay. Uh, okay. 31. Yeah, that works. So we have to count 15 pipes in. All right. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Okay. Right here. Yep, right there. Let's, uh, I'll paint this stuff so you can see it. That's a good point. And two more that, from that. That's the midpoint. Yep. Okay. So... Uh, I'm thinking, what if, what if we had an alternate version of the staircase? No! <laughs> okay. It's okay. Hear me out. We're going to have the alternate version of the staircase. Okay, so what is going to My be... My reaction is going was to not to that. <laughs> it's going, it's, oh, did you fall? You fell. Yes. Okay, so what I was thinking is we could put this thing on a controller and have it rotate upwards... So, like, if you fall like a off... corkscrew? Well, if you fall off, you press a button at the bottom, and it will rotate up, uh, so that you can, uh, like, you, it will, like, rotate sideways. So you can, um... So you can, like, really hop on and take up. it up. Here, I'll so you're start... saying if you fall off, you should be able to, like, have this thing rotate to pick you up off the ground? Yes. But it's not going to be tall enough to do that. I mean, we could put, like, a, a staircase up to, like, a, you know, a very short staircase to a, a, a platform. Kind of like a Ferris wheel. You know, Ferris oh, wheels sometimes have, like, the, the oh, thing Oh, yeah, okay, that them. could work. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're gonna have to delete this entire walkway, but once we get this thing built, it shouldn't be a problem. And the yeah. nice thing is I can discon disconnect it from the structure, so it shouldn't matter. What about using, like, like metal windows or something here? Huh. It's a pretty big tiles. Oh, this is even better looking. This might be easier to build with, too. Okay. Oh, those look kind of neat, actually. Yeah, and I'm actually digging them quite a bit. Right. And then these have a... This doesn't even count on this side, so... This should work. That's one... Then we have another two there. Okay, let's uh, paint these okay, as well. This is a good place to put that elbow joint. Okay. Hmm. This is surprisingly messy. It That's doesn't okay. surprise me. I'm just trying to like design the uh, the car. So f I think at first we'll just do a basic seat. We'll probably. Oh wait, no, 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 no. We do not want metal. This thing is heavy as hell. I just saw the like whole thing just tip this a little. Is sag. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't want to do that. I guess we don't need a we don't need a basic seat. We can have a toilet. Come to think of it. Okay, let's do that. Uh, toilet, toilet. They said in uh, recent patch notes apparently they're adding a uh... a controllable three seat. Yeah. Like one that is steering. Oh God. Excellent. Uh, bad news. Uh, what? Putting the toilet on made it fuck up like nothing else. I didn't see the toilet on it. Let's see it. Okay. Watch this. 
Whoa, hey. It's the Jittermobtron. I want to see what happens if I, like, try to, like, get rotated off on that thing. You mean, okay, so we put you on a Because I want to see if it, like, sags and I just, like, like plummet, basically. Okay. This, uh, you can even just hammer it, probably. Can I? Because to fix, like, to re, like, stabilize it, all you need to do is, uh... Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna have to get out for a second. Get over here. Oh. Uh, well, that was terrifying. Yes. I forgot I have to connect this. Problem is, this might be causing undue lag on the system. Yeah, but it'll be funny. It's true. Whatever happens. Okay. Because the toilet's involved. <laughs> this is a good point. Okay. Hop on. I'll finish programming it. Okay. Let's just do... Farewell, uh, farewell young birdman. Whoa! Um... Huh. Um... <laughs> it's got a lot to go. <laughs> okay, give me that a second. That was... Let's, let's crank this shit down a little bit. Yes, please. Okay. That was... That was the teacups ride from hell. Jesus Christ! <laughs> It's still so fast. <laughs> okay. It's legitimately, it's still really, really fast. So the thing is, it's got so Why much. Is it so, it, it's got so it's much. It's a long arm. It just has crazy horsepower, Wait, basically. What? It's supposed to be at a. Oh, I never saved it or something. I don't know. You never okay. actually cranked the speed down. Oh, no, on the uh, controller. God, fucking. I'm trying to set it down to 180, but it's not uh -huh. taking. Uh, is it... You might go... Up, oh, yep. Okay. This is the worst feeling ever right now. Oh my god. <laughs> this has got some... I kinda, I kinda wanna keep this. Whatever yeah. you wanna call this. I, I, I this wanna... sure as hell has some character to it. I like it too, so we'll we'll keep it. But we need to have the toilet the toilets facing other direction, so when you get off, you don't plummet. That <laughs> plummet. But there's no time for this laughter right now. Can you please summon me to the other end? I'm afraid if I get off here, I'll just fall. But I can. I think I can reasonably survive if I get off on the other end. Okay, hold on. I got to do a thing. Okay. I gotta, put, I, gotta know, I gotta put another controller down. There's a second bearing. I was thinking, this could actually work. What's uh, the second bearing? So you can do head rolls while you get <laughs> flung around at 70 miles per hour? The second bearing is so uh, both sides can control it. Oh, I see. Damn. Oh, clever. Yeah. So and that way we can turn on both at the same time and have the worst idea ever. <laughs> I don't know if it would go anywhere, or it would go It really everywhere. wouldn't make a difference. Alright. Bird? Wait, I gotta program the other one. Maiden Voyage. Yeah. I have no idea what this is going to do. Um, so just bear with me a second. Wait. Oh, I see why we ran into issues last time. I, since I don't have a bigger screen, uh, uh -huh. me trying to control the uh... controller settings is like yeah. hard. Yeah. All right, ready? Oh shit! Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I gotta bring it back. This on mine. Oh god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> stop, <laughs> stop whatever you're doing. I'm already dead. <laughs> okay. Let me hop in my seat. Alright. Okay. You ready, you ready to go? Alright, yeah. so I'm gonna press mine. <laughs> <laughs> this is not intentional, but apparently the centripetal force is just so amazing <laughs> that this happens. Yes. Okay. 
Now press yours. It should bring us back. <laughs> oh, I see. That's clever. So one brings us one direction, the other brings us the other. And they're opposed to each other. So yeah. it works as intended. Um, with some unexpected <laughs> consequences. <laughs> oh, we've turned them both on at the same time. <laughs> well, I think we have our, uh, uh... I think we have our travel device. Yeah, it's remarkably stupid. <laughs> and incredibly scary to use. <laughs> I need so, to put the other seat back down on it. Because I took it off so that it... Because it faces the wrong direction. Business, faces the worst possible direction. Business as usual for us. What? What? Did you bring it, be, did you bring it back? Oh no. Uh, no. What have you done? What is this? Why is this it's happening? Okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. I undid everything. Okay, so I'm gonna press my switch. You, you redid it, why? Because I want to come back to where you are! I don't think you can. Oh, Hi! There we are. I Hi. am here now. How's it going? Please, whatever you do, don't do that! <laughs> <laughs> huh. Maybe I should not have all of these plus or minus 360 degree things. That seems like a good plan. Aw, oh, man, I just lag fell down the elevator shaft. <laughs> At least it works. <laughs> well, works is definitely an interesting way to describe whatever is happening. I'm gonna hit the E key. And it got stuck. Oh! What? That The thing that is, though... That that, like, that is very, like, um, death racy to have, like, a gigantic spinning death thing that Oh, yeah, we could totally, cliffs. we could totally yeah. do stuff. And Let's it's see. glorious. Jake, man, you're asking me to play Undertale? I have a playthrough of Undertale. And did you fix the, uh... Yeah, yeah, it's not, I okay. mean, it's still, it still rockets you off to the other side of the universe, but... It's fine. Well, here's your issue. You what? Dingus. What did I do? You can set the controller speeds. Where's the fun in that? The, uh, I mean, look, this is it on maximum slow, and look at how sane it is. <laughs> and safe feeling. Do you see my stretched out dwarven ass? It's so much better than, like, the death motron that this thing was before. I liked that, though. Fine, fine. Here you go. It's back up to fast. Back up to fast. Okay. Go ahead and give it another test. Yeah, this is good. I like this. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is nowhere tall enough. We'll just use... Ah! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, my God. How come this worked this time when I was on it? I don't know, man. I turned on the loop. Because I wasn't having enough fun. And then I got on. I wily coyoted myself. I attempted to punk you out. <laughs> and then I just have to trap myself to see if it works. And it works. Alright, we'll just oh, turn man. it off real quick. This is like the first time we've had drunk bot in like months. Oh, yeah, you're having your mead. Mm hmm. Alright, let's turn off the loop. Now that I've finished wily coyote. Wow. Yeah. It's we fun watching the rotators just freak out with the connector tool. <laughs> I like Put it switches though. On. Yeah, it's cool. So now there what? We are. Um, I feel like I feel like I should well, get rid of to, the rest of the platform. We need to take platform. out the we need to take out the rest of the platform. Yeah. Okay. Why won't you know, this I... thing stop anymore? Wait, what? 
It, how? What the hell? Okay, whatever. I'm really confused as to what's going on with this thing. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. So here's the question: Are we gonna Are we gonna connect this from the bottom? Are we gonna connect this off of the uh, supports, like the the side of the tree houses? Uh, why don't you just leave one block in the middle? Here, I'll do it. So a very thin little connection from one tree house to the other, or maybe yeah. from one tree house to the middle block. So if I do something like this, that's what you're talking about, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so like surface walkway style, you can kind of walk across this, but it, normally it would be like hella dangerous. Yeah, because our our actual implementation is not hella dangerous. Let's leave the colored uh, you... blocks, though. They look nice. You might want to yeah. back up. You might want to, like, turn around. Okay. Otherwise, I feel like I'm getting threatened by a... a like, as, like I'm a cowboy or something. Like, you gotta get out here, partner. You better back up now, boy. Somebody's gonna be on the receiving end of this revolver. Oh, you shit. <laughs> Excellent pun. Oh. You know, I wasn't gonna do anything. <laughs> I was just gonna sit there and shit. Wait, oh, god damn it! Did you leave the elevator at the top? You did. No, what? No, Where I didn't. F Where the fuck's the elevator? It's at the bottom. I dropped it off the edge of the world. Oh, I see where it is. Uh-oh. Well, then, um... Oh, I found it. That's okay. Yeah. That's okay. It's lodged in some stones. I figured it out. Okay, good. Maybe, maybe slightly on the booze hall But I'm not stupid a hall uh, did it get current stuck? Current pun indicators say that yes, you, you're, yeah. Um, did it get stuck? The answer to that question is a solid yes. Okay, because it's had like a hundred percent success rate for me, which is amazing. Oh god. Yeah, no. I think it might just be me. Oh no. Oh game, are you okay? Okay. It's just the elevator hitting bottom. Rock bottom is apparently bad frame rate land. Uh, is it at rock bottom again? What's the deal now? You know, I, I don't know yet. I'm gonna go see what's wrong. <laughs> okay. Shouldn't be having issues. Honestly, I think I'm gonna get rid of your sensor. Oh, you know what? The sensor won't stop sensing. Yeah, it's a very sensitive sensor. Yeah, but that, that means, like, uh, whatever... Even if you don't have anything, it's just like, I am sensing stuff. Uh, yeah. Still sensing, and since this is like such a <laughs> overstressed world. Yeah. We definitely are pushing this game to the limits with this build. Yeah. This actually, with combined with the metal blocks, is a really nice look. It looks like the side of like some weird tank or something. Yeah. House B does not look like a friendly place to be. I'm okay with it. It's just it, got this, I like... I told you we need, we need different aesthetics. Yeah. 